<laughs> right. Okay, it is 631. Let's start off with some developing news for you on this Tuesday. Austin police are still trying to figure out if two shootings not too far from each other in South Austin are connected. I'm Sally Hernandez. I'm Amanda Dugan. Tom has the morning off. One of those shootings happened at South Congress Avenue near William Cannon Drive around 845 last night. One person is dead. The second shooting a mile and a half away at South Congress and Stastny Lane right around the same time. Two people are hurt but expected to be okay. 911 callers alerted police to the first shooting saying they heard gunshots and saw a man staggering and hurt. When police arrived, they found him shot multiple times. He died at the hospital. No one is in custody. This is Austin's 82nd homicide of the year. Okay, Xane is tracking Austin's homicides because, as Maddie mentioned, 82 is the most that the city has ever had in one year, and the year's not over. We also wanted to look at the rate of homicides considering our population growth. So right now, Austin's seeing about eight and a half homicides per 100,000 people. Compare that to last year. Austin saw about five homicides per 100,000. The highest year on record back in the 1980s, 1984, we had 59 homicides that's that year, 59 significant drop from our current rate. But because the population was much lower in the 80s, the rate turned out to be 13.2 per 100,000. Just some perspective to give you an idea of what Austin police are dealing with.